Good morning, Wolves, and welcome to your Wellness Monday Advisory lesson. Um, today, I have Miss Albrecht here. Do you want to introduce yourself? Yeah. Hi, everyone. I'm Miss A or Miss Albrecht. I'm Miss Vargas's social work intern, so I'm here um, just helping her this year. Yeah. Um, and Miss A is going to help me out in leading our lesson today. And in fact, I am going to let her take the lead here. So I'll introduce our lesson. Um, and then we'll get started. Um, so today we are focusing on a tool called the three wins. And I feel like this tool could be very helpful for right about now because we are about a little over halfway through this trimester. I know it's shocking, right? Flies by. And we're getting ready to really focus on getting those grades up before finals. And sometimes that can be a little bit of a stressful experience. Um, and so for today's lesson, um, I want to share with you a common phrase in brain science that is neurons that fire together get wired together. So essentially, when a certain thought is activated and reinforced, those neural pathways in the brain become stronger and more automatic. For example, if you frequently think that you are um, maybe not smart enough, that thought pattern becomes your go-to way of thinking about yourself when you're in the classroom. But there's really good news. Our brains are incredible machines that have the ability to change through the process of neuroplasticity. So through this practice, we can rewire our brains to intentionally and routinely focus on the good. We have the ability to be active directors of our own thoughts. And so today, we are going to make the best use of our brain's power by learning a quick tool called the three wins um, that can easily become a routine to shape the way you automatically think. I invite you to join me in this practice, and at the end, we're going to reflect on our experience. So while you're working through this tool, let's give everyone the opportunity to practice it, and then afterwards, we'll reflect as an advisory. Ms. A, would you like to take it away? Yeah, so today's writing, or excuse me, today's tool is a writing-based tool, so you are going to need to get out a writing utensil and a piece of paper or your laptop or something to document your answers on, um, so go ahead and get that out now. Um, so we are going to start, before we get into today's tool, we are going to start with th taking three deep breaths. I think you guys should be pretty familiar with this. I think this is how most of the activities start. So go ahead and close your eyes or shift your gaze to the floor if it's not comfortable to have your eyes closed or kind of shift your gaze down to the end of your nose, um, whatever is most comfortable for you. And I invite you to place one hand on your chest and one hand on your belly. Now inhale through your nose, feel your chest rise and your belly expand. Once you've inhaled, go ahead and pause. Now slowly exhale through your mouth and feel your belly deflate. So again, go ahead and inhale through your nose for one, two, three. Pause for one, two, three. And slowly exhale out of your mouth for one, two, three. Last one, go ahead and take the biggest inhale of your day for one, two, three. Pause for one, two, three. Now slowly exhale for one, two, three. Now gently go ahead and open your eyes. Okay, so today we're going to intentionally search for the good in our lives by answering a simple question. And that question that we're going to think about is what are three wins that you can claim for today? So typically when we think about wins, that might be something like getting an A on a test or getting a new job or, you know, get having perfect attendance or kind of some of these bigger picture things that are wins. But we want you to really be thinking about some of those smaller wins. And so the great thing about doing this activity during your advisory is it's your first period. You haven't had a whole lot of your day yet. Um, so you probably haven't done a whole lot of stuff. So we really want you to be thinking about in the time that you've been awake till this moment, like what are some small wins you've had? Maybe that's just 
eating breakfast, right? That's a win. Or maybe it's getting to school on time. Maybe you were got along with your brother or sister this morning or didn't get into a fight or a disagreement with your parents. Whatever that might be, there hasn't been a whole lot of time today, so that's going to kind of force you to really think about what are those small things that you've done this morning that you can count as wins that you might not have even noticed before now. So we want to give you a minute to think about, again, that question is, what are three wins you can claim today, this morning? Again, small things, getting some fresh air, whatever that looks like for you. So advisors, um, you can go ahead and pause this video now to give your class a minute to think about three wins that they've had this morning. So Miss A, I am curious, I'm going to put you on the spot. Yeah, go ahead. What are your three wins from today? Well, so we're going to go with smaller wins and smaller moments. My daughter really struggles in the morning. She's very grumpy when she wakes up, and I snap at her a lot to get her out the house quicker. So I didn't snap at her today. I was very chill with her today. Was one win. Um, a second win would be uh, some of the things I planned to do today didn't work out, and I just spent some time reading and kind of catching up on reading material. So that was a second win. And a third win would be... Um, I think I showed up and really engaged when people were wanting to talk to me about things. I tried to be present, not be focused on other distractions. Nice! That's awesome. Those are some great wins. Thanks. My three wins are I was able to drink all my coffee this morning. Mm -hmm. That's essential for, for me. Sure. I ate breakfast. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Um, and I slept extremely well last night. Awesome. Great yeah. wins. So you can see they're all small doable things. We're just taking time to highlight the things we're already doing and celebrate them as wins because they are. Yeah. All right. So at this time, advisors, if any of your students would like to share out their three wins, even if they're really small, now is a great time to do so. Um, and maybe talk about where you might use this tool in your daily life. If you like this tool, um, and if you didn't like it, that's completely fine. This is a journey that wavers, and what didn't work for you today, it, it could work tomorrow. And there's also so many tools that we're learning this year that we're sure you'll find some that really work for you. We hope you have an excellent start to your week, and we'll talk to you next time. All right, everyone. Take care. Bye. Bye.